here with my man, Bryce Harper, of course, a two-time MVP. Bryce, it's been amazing seeing your journey, your success, and I think I'm most impressed by this. You come back from Tommy John faster than any position player ever, and you go, you know what, I'll do first base. <laughs> How did that first come about? Yeah, um, just making sure that Bomer uh, was at third base every day. You know, being able to have a rookie player like that or a younger player like that be comfortable every day at his position, um, that was our main goal. And, you know, being able to go to first base, um, understanding it was going to be some hard work. But, uh, you know, working with Bobby every single day, um, getting on the half field as much as possible here in spring training, um, trying to just, you know, get better and better each day, understanding the factors of the game and, um, you know, where to be on the field and things like that. Um, it's been really good, been a lot of fun, and uh, I look forward to trying to get even better over there each day. So my partner in crime, Harold Reynolds, says to me, he goes, <laughs> he goes, Bryce is going to stay at first base. I said, no, no, it's just temporary. He's just doing it to get back. He's a right fielder. He goes, no, no, he's going to stay. And now that is the case. When did that decision get made? I don't want to give Harold credit. No, but yeah, uh, this offseason, we kind of went over it. Obviously, we had an incredible first baseman, Reese Hoskins, and we were sad to see him go. Yeah. Um, but we had that conversation this offseason, and, um, you know, we talked about it as a team and or as a, as a front office and as a whole. And, um, you know, talked about, you know, with Dombrowski about it for length and asked him, you know, where do you want me? You know, if you want me in right, obviously I'll go back out there and I'll play, you know, the best I can out there. And if you want me at first base, and you know, I'll try to be the best I can over there. So we solidified it that we were going to be at first base. And um, from that point on, just tried to turn my attention to first base and trying to get better over there. And um, that's how it's you know kind of been all spring. It's amazing just being around here, being around the guys, Rob Thompson, the whole crew. Like you just have an incredible clubhouse. What can you say about the chemistry? The fact everyone seems to have their own personality. You guys are able to to have a cohesion to you. Yeah, from the top to bottom. I mean, from our owner John Milton to Dombrowski to you know Tomper to our whole staff. I mean, we have such a such a great staff and such a great group of guys that we can work with each day throughout our whole organization. And um, you know, I think Middleton's done such a good job of just bringing that group of guys in and bringing that core in and understanding the value in a lot of players and a lot of staff and. Um, he's done such a great job of making this feel like we're just a family over here and that we can enjoy each other each day in the clubhouse and get to know each other even more. And, um, you know, it's good coming into camp, kind of seeing similar faces and knowing a lot of guys. Mm -hmm. um, so we can kind of just get right to work, understand we don't have to get to know anybody else or anything like that. We can, you know, kind of stay the same course and understand where we need to be as a team and then get back there. I, I can't imagine as an athlete having more pride than being to elevate come postseason. And you've been able to do that consistently. Where does that come from? It's just a lot of fun. You know, you can't, you can't be scared to fail either. I think that's a big thing, right? I think people get scared of failure and uh, get scared of losing and things like that. But you just got to be grateful for the moment and grateful for the opportunity. Um, no matter if you come through or you don't, just understanding that you have the opportunity is really cool. Mm -hmm. um, you just go out there and, and play your same game and try to do that to the best of your ability. Obviously, as a team, we haven't got to the pinnacle of winning a championship. Mm -hmm. um, but, you know, we're hoping that we can get there this year. And we got a great group of guys, got a good team. And uh, we're looking forward to this season and, and just going about it.